Now, I've been thinking about how to bridge the gap between people like us and people like your cell phone using normies, okay? How can we reach those people? How can we, who don't have Facebooks or Twitter or all that kind of stuff, how can we be accessible to them, all right? Now, if you know what you're doing on computers, you probably use RSS feeds. I use RSS feeds for everything, okay? That's where I get my news or sites that I want to see updated. That's where I get, you know, their updates. That's how I tell people what I'm doing on my RSS feed. Uh, and I have an RSS feed for everything, my website, my podcast, my, uh, my video channel, everything, okay? Now, of course, normal humans out there, they don't know how to use RSS feeds. That's a hard thing. Oh, I gotta get it. Well, it's not actually a hard thing, but they don't know about it. Therefore, it's difficult. Doesn't matter how easy it is. That's how people think. So how do you bridge the gap between that? Now, I was thinking about this, okay? Here's the idea. The idea is, um, let's say, this would actually be probably the easiest thing to do. I can't do it because I don't know anything about cell phone programming, but for some of you guys, I, be I bet multiple people could probably do this within a day, so I will give the idea to you. Um, imagine taking an RSS feed and having a system which can just take any RSS feed and automatically convert it into a cell phone app. Okay, so you have a cell phone app that really just takes one parameter, an RSS feed, and it generates, uh, you know, basically instead of, like instead of having my blog or let's say my podcast's RSS feed, uh, you could have the not related cell phone app and I don't have to think about managing that application. It's just a system that reads the RSS feed and of course RSS uh, feeds, they can take images, uh, you can have, you know, images for the whole thing, you can have images for individual entries, and you can actually have something like a app, you know, an app on your phone that just is reading raw H, you know, or raw uh, RSS, and it generates a, you know, thing that a normie could use. Now, you might say, oh, well, why don't they just use RSS feed readers? Well, that's because they don't understand them. What normies want, they want one app for something that they like that they can put on their home screen. And I think that's a good idea, and I think it would actually solve other problems. Another thing I occasionally do, you know, when I do a live stream, um, you know, I don't have a Twitter or anything like that, so I will put out an announcement on my blog. Well, it'd be really nice if people could get push notifications uh, or some kind of notification on their phone if they want it if I put up a blog post, which would include those kind of announcements. So it'd be very nice, like this kind of system would be very nice because it would take technology that we use and it's very consistent and that you know frankly is very extensible and you can use it for a lot of things uh, but it would make it accessible to you know normies out there basically uh, they would be able to use in effect RSS in a way that th they wouldn't even know that they're using RSS and given that that actually is good for us additionally not just because we're reaching more people but also because um, you know there's uh, it gets more people in the RSS. RSS becomes something, oh, you can just, you know, make an RSS feed and then automatically get a cell phone app with it. So anyone out there, this would probably be a pretty easy thing for anyone knows who knows how RSS feeds work um, and, uh, you know, is sort of familiar with them and or sort of familiar with cell phone applications. Now, again, I don't really know anything about cell phone apps, uh, but this is, I mean, computationally, I'm just thinking it like, uh, thinking about it like that. It would probably be a very easy thing to do. So, uh, I don't know, this is just an idea out there. If you come up with something like that, and I think this is the kind of thing that, you know, someone could draft up in a day or so, uh, you know, make me aware of it, email it to me, and I'm, I might use it, I mean, if you guys come up with something good. Um, but, uh, yeah, get, put more suggestions in the, the comments or whatever if you have them, because uh, I think this is one of those things, I, it, it would be extremely useful for me, and I think it would be extremely useful for a bunch of nor. I'm mostly thinking about this because... I was going to do more episodes of the podcast, but I really don't want to use like all this Google, uh, Apple, you know, iTunes kind of stuff. I really just want an individual app, but I don't want to have to manage it. But it's easy enough to generate an RSS feed, so I don't have to worry about it. And it'd be very nice if I could give normies, oh, here's an app, which is really just my RSS feed uh, that they can put on their phone if they want to, you know, look at something. Anyway, that's it. That's the idea.